Welcome back to our Wednesday Lent uh, prayer practice experiences. This week, we're going to try something called a loving kindness meditation. And this is not, didn't originate within Christianity, but it's something that fits perfectly within our tradition, especially after last Sunday talking about forgiveness and remembering Jesus gave a really difficult command to love not only your neighbor and yourself, but to love your enemies and to pray for those who persecute you. So this is an exercise where we give these feelings of blessing, of goodwill towards other people. And this is a practice, so it may not connect with you right away, but if it's something that connects with you at some level, you may try it again and again, and it may speak with you more the more that you get used to it, the more that you practice it. So now I invite you to make yourself comfortable, to close your eyes if that helps you to concentrate and to focus on your breath. And with each breath in, you can imagine that you are taking in God's love for you. And with each breath out, you are letting out all the things you don't need right now. So you breathe in, you take in God's love, and you breathe out the tension in your body. You breathe in, taking in God's and you breathe out the stress that you don't need right now. So take a moment to focus on your breath and then we'll start this practice. So now I want you to picture someone who you find it really easy to love. Someone who you really love loves you. Maybe this is a spouse or a parent or a child, a really good friend, someone that you really love. And close your eyes and picture that person as if they were standing or sitting right in front of you. Really try and picture them in your mind as if they were right there. The expression on their face, what they're wearing. Picture that person who you deeply love. And notice how you feel picturing this person your heart starts to open up. Now, still picturing this person that you love sitting or standing right in front of you, I want you to repeat these words after me as you send them a blessing. Repeat these words. May you be well. May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be loved. Again, notice how you feel. Notice how your heart is open towards this person who you deeply love. Now I want you to picture someone else. Someone that you like. Someone that you're close with, but not as close as you were with that first person. A good friend, maybe. And again, picture this person who you like sitting or standing right in front of you. And try and open your heart in the same way, have those same feelings of warmth and goodwill that you had towards that first person as you picture this person that you like in front of you. And say these same words of blessing to them. Repeat after me. May you be well. May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be loved. Now we're gonna take a step back. And I want you to picture someone now who you don't have any strong feelings toward. You don't really like them, but you don't really dislike them either because you simply don't know them that well. Maybe this is someone who you see when you go to the grocery store, someone you see in passing at school, work, someone that you don't have strong feelings one way or the other toward. And again, try and open your heart the same way that you have towards those first two people. And picture this person standing or sitting right in front of you as you give them this blessing. May you be well. May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be loved. Now 
Now this next part is the hardest part of this practice. Sometimes the people that we find it really difficult to love can close our hearts. And so I want you to try and keep your heart open as you picture someone now who you find it very difficult to love. This is someone maybe you have had argued. Maybe it's someone who has hurt you or continues to hurt you. And we are gonna try and open our hearts to this person as well. Now remember, sometimes there are very good reasons to cut off relationships. And just because you love and forgive someone doesn't mean that you have to stay close with them. But we don't have to let those people keep our hearts closed. So try and open your heart as you picture this person who you find very difficult to love sitting or standing right in front of you and say these words of blessing to them. May you be well. May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be loved. Now we're gonna end this practice by saying this same blessing to yourself. Because we remember that Jesus calls us to love our enemies and to love our neighbors as we love ourselves. And sometimes that's actually the most difficult thing of all is to offer ourselves the same grace and love that we extend to someone else. So now, say these same words of blessing to yourself. May you be well. May you be happy. May you be peaceful. May you be loved. Know, people of God, that you are loved. You are forgiven already. Amen.